Yo, 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 what is up? That's funny, C4. I, I didn't even see what anybody was typing, and you was like, yo, what up? <laughs> That's funny as hell. Man, I overslept like a motherfucker. Chopper, chopper! What up? Overslept like a motherfucker. Retired driver, what up? Yeah, well... This is why, y'all. Yes, that's a burger, but I made it like a donut shape and then put two eggs in the middle of it. <laughs> what up, Kevin? Good to see you. Toe for life. With a pretzel bun. Oh, it's fire. Better than hundreds and fifties and thighs and titties. Waiting on your neuropathy medicine to kick in. Man, I hope you uh, get some relief from that, bro. Well, I don't know. There ain't much better than that, but... Deborah, welcome in. How you doing? Get going, y'all. Here in uh, about five minutes. Friends and code, what's up, brother? Let's see. Uh, I made it early, early this morning. I think it was just before 3 o'clock or something like that, 2 o'clock. But then I overslept after I ate, so, you know. Let's see. up here and see where I need to get fuel at. I think we're going to try and get do it in Nevada. Yes, retired driver, it sure will, my friend. Oh, shit, fuel goes down two cents after midnight. Or goes up two cents. All right, TA Mill City, here we come. If we can make it that far. We 
may not be able to make it that far. We'll see, see what happens. Mill City, Nevada is where we'll be getting fuel. Hey, Joko. Retired driver, did you see the burger I made, bro? <laughs> That's why I passed a book out. <laughs> It's a half pound burger, by the way. Two eggs, half pound of burger, uh, six strips of bacon and about a cup of shredded cheese. Hey Mike Webb, what's up brother? Hey Snake, good to see you. <laughs> yeah, chopper probably. <laughs> <coughs> I should have been should have been rolling by six seven o'clock, but I do I I have a little bit of leeway, but we got to get going. It's time to roll. I'm hoping to be stopped by no later than six thirty in the morning. Then I can roll by four thirty. And I have to be in Tracy, California by 3.45 a.m. So, no time to, like the present, all right? That, Mike, I have no idea where I'm going after that. No clue, bro. I won't know until maybe tomorrow, but I probably won't know until I'm unloaded in Tracy. Indoctrinated. Hello, hello, hello. Yeah, I know. Another late night stream by that asshole Midwest. I mean, by that, by that, that great guy Callahan.
Yeah, we could do, we could do that, Mike Webb, for sure. Welcome in, sir. Long time no see. How you doing? in the GPS is 600 and might as well call it 650 miles. <coughs> uh, Leo, my day just getting started so ask me later, bro. <laughs> My GPS wants to be funky and tell me it's not charging. What the hell? What the hell, Bobby? Damn it, Bobby. Thank you, Cap Mobby. It's Mike Webb. <laughs> Brandon Mist Mitchell. What's up, brother? <coughs> at least rolling late at night, you don't have a lot of traffic to deal with. And pulling into a truck stop early morning, you don't have to fight for a parking spot, so. A um, couple links that, do I still have a moderator in chat? A couple links I would like people to share if they could. One of them right there, friends and code. <coughs> Won't say that in Cali, yeah, right. <laughs> All right, here's friends and code, guys. Go over and check out some of the cool shit he's doing over there. Go check him out. Let him know that Callahan slash Midwest sent you. And a banana. Welcome in. It all just crashed. What the hell? Give him, give him a chance to get it all restarted, guys. And he'll be back to it. Not much of a coder if he can't keep his computer up and running. 
Just kidding, bud. <laughs> <coughs> The other guy I want you guys to go check out is Indoctrination. He does all kinds of shit on his channel. There's a link for that. It's like a mechanic in his fucking car. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't know about best, Brandon Mitchell. You can't leave out No Name Coder. one hell of a guy right there too. Maybe between the two of them we can spice up Callahan's live streaming. <coughs> 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 <laughs> They've got a lot, a lot on their hands trying to get that um, the permanent record going. So, big shout out to those guys for that. That's an awesome program. end of the day today or end of my shift I'm probably going to be looks like Winnemucca, Nevada around in that area Sacramento, so we'll be going through northern Nevada. Hopefully they got that big protest shut down and the traffic in Sacramento won't be affected by that protest in San Francisco on the Golden Gate Bridge. See you, sir. How are you? Yeah, I saw that, bud. That was crazy. I don't get behind that shit either. Don't get in the way of my commerce. I'll run your ass over. Three days gambling in Winnemucca. Hey, no problem, Doc. You do your you do your poker thing, man. No problem, bro.
Everybody, please go over there and give Doc indoctrination, a like, and a subscription if you would. Good dude. make this perfectly clear right now if I say that someone's a good dude and it comes out later they're not a good dude I retract my statement if you got a fucking uh, a charge on your record where you're a kitty diddler your best bet is to stay the fuck off YouTube because it will get found out and we don't condone that here at Callahan's or on Midwest Accountability. Kitty diddlers need not apply. Stay the fuck out of here. Hey, Andrew, good to see you, bro. So that's my disclaimer. Do I do I realize that you know the cops do dirty shit and sometimes and, and females lie and sometimes get, guys get wrapped up? Yes. But other than that, we don't need none of that P, P Kitty Diddler bullshit going on. Hey someone, hey Exy, good to see you, bro. good man still says your name man well for the record Mike Webb I try to give everybody a chance it doesn't always work out sometimes you come across people that are pieces of shit um, and, and let's make this clear, too, that nothing has been explained in that circumstance either. So I don't know the backstory behind it. I know what I was told, and I know what's been shown on the web. So... people it just got started exy so ask me here in about nine hours <laughs> that upset some people. Lost a half the chat. Damn it, man. No gives a fuck. Hey, Dennis, good to see you, bud. How are you? Hey, C4, you want to hear something funny? IP, 
Welcome in. How you doing? All right. Well, I hope you get some good sleep. that person you were just talking about they think that they're gonna get a discount on a computer for being a content creator Well, hop in the bunk, get you some rest. We'll wake you up when it's your stop. <coughs> That's what most people do here. They hop in the bunk and they just ride along, rest. No, not for me. Or buy a brand new computer, they think they're a discount for being a content creator. Uh, yeah, Andrew, I will agree. Being a content creator is legit work if you're a content creator. It's only 39 degrees. That's not a good sign. Snarky, what's up, brother? Good to see you. No, no, C4. What's the last sentence you said before I said something about it? There you go. <laughs> Anna. Much love. Thanks for stopping in. Where am I at? Uh, just outside of Wham Sutter. Wham Sutter, Wyoming. Oh, IP. Yeah, yeah. IP's going to, going to sleep. You right, Anna. Come on, dude. Look. I don't know why you got over in the left lane so damn early in the first place. You can't even pass somebody. It's your piece of shit freight shaker. You kidding me? I hope you had a good day, though, other than being, you know, sore. I hope you had a good day, man. Hey, C4. Those people, their theme, theme song should be, I'm my own grandpa. <laughs> It's so funny, I know, but it really is so. I'm my own grandpa. Yeah, 
Yeah, what was that movie with Tom Arnold? Wasn't that Tom Arnold that was in that movie that <coughs> that was a song in there? sort of from the area I grew up in. The stupids, there it is. In a roundabout way, kind of, sort of. I'm not going to say too much more. Let's just say that there have been parties where we, we've both been there at the same time. Didn't really associate with the guy. But they weren't huge parties either, so. I also worked for him at the Big Food Diner. the Big Food Diner. Well, I think the building's still there. I don't know if they've done anything with it. I haven't lived in the area since uh, 98. Exit. Right, C4. sandwich places is right there down the road in uh, Ottumwa, Iowa. Canteen Lunch in the Alley. Oh my God. Some me, Anna. Some me. Others, you know, I don't. I don't feel like walking into a, you know, a meat locker. <laughs> or rolling into it, or you know, cartwheeling into it. Uh, I am just outside of Wham Sutter, Wyoming. Dennis. So yes, kinda. I I did a I did my break in uh, in Rollins. So I'm a few hours outside of Casper.
And uh, let's just say I don't feel like uh, putting on spelunking gear when I, you know, I mean, uh, okay, so, yeah. Anyway, new subject. <laughs> take me to Arby's. Because they got the meats. Of like beef stock or something like that, I'm, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> right, R&R? &R? B. Hendrix, what's up, brother? Fried chicken sounds good as hell. So Anna, I'll show you what I had for for my meal when I stopped for the day. And here is an inside cut of it. It's a half pound burger with two eggs, six strips of bacon, half cup of shredded cheese, uh, cheddar jack cheese, and a pretzel bun. was delicious. It was so good I didn't even need no mayonnaise or mustard or anything like that. And usually I put shit like that on my sandwiches, so... I want that in my mouth. Andrew, anything you cook yourself is better than fast food, bro. <coughs> I don't know, Mike Webb. I don't check my cholesterol. <laughs> uh, yeah, I love bacon. die anyway. I might as well die happy. You know what I mean? Eggsy? Oh, shit. And, uh, 
I guess it depends on who's cooking it. Gordon Ramsay could probably pull it off. It could be bachelor, it could be married, it could be all kinds of fairy dust. The bacon is the miracle food. The only problem is, now y'all are going to laugh at me for this, or make fun of me, but being I, that, that I'm in the truck, I don't keep regular bacon in here not for breakfast items. I have microwave bacon in here. It's just, it's way more convenient and you don't have to refrigerate it until you open the package. So I like Sam's Club or, or Costco or whatever, get the big packages of microwavable bacon. I usually bring a couple of those with me. And since I'm gonna be out here for a couple more months yet, I'm probably gonna have to stop somewhere and get me some more. <coughs> oh, did it really? B. Hendrix? Wow. I don't know, R&R. &R. That microwave bacon is pretty damn good. You, brother welcome in well if you do like a for Thanksgiving if you do like a deep fried turkey doing it in peanut oil is amazing Or, or what he's doing to the to the entire United States? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pre cooked bacon approved. Oh, thanks, Snarky. So, uh, Snarky, what are you doing now? What you end up? Uh, what you end up uh, getting a job as? If you don't mind me asking. Things make really good gravy, Eggsy. Oh, hell yeah, Snarky. Very cool, man. You get discount on meats. If so, I'll come see you. <laughs> well, duh, Anna. Well, I'll come see you anyway, Snarky. How about that? Frank Perez! Welcome in, sir. How you doing?
Oh God, Anna. <laughs> That's it. That's funny as hell. <laughs> there you go, Snarky. Nothing wrong with that, bro. Silver Ogre. What's up, buddy? Uh, I slept for most of it, Silver, so... here now, Hexy. Well, the temperature did go up. What's wrong? Andrew, you ain't got no miles or what? Yeah, I'm getting that rain right now, R&R. That's right, yeah. Andrew Andrew broke his phone and he doesn't have access to his regular account, guys. Thank you, Havoc. Oh my god. Just fucking just tweak my back. What the fuck? Oh, this is going to be a long night. Ow. Yeah, that was a couple of hummers on there, Anna. Because this road is so damn bumpy, I don't know. I bought him out on one of the bumps here and it just sent my back in a frenzy. brother Doc, no worries at all, bro. You do what you gotta do. I don't expect people to be here all the time. I don't, don't even expect people to be here at all. So, I appreciate everybody that does pop in and, and all that, so...
this is just a place for people to come in and hang out, have a good time. Hop in a bunk, get some sleep. Again, help channels grow is what we'd like to do here. Good Lord, the service sucks tonight. Holy fuck. gonna be a painful ride having I overslept? Yes, it would. Hold on. Friends of 
code, I'll ask him. Push through it, Heavy. Dennis Strackmore, welcome in. Oh, there he is. There's the Doc. would be badass, friends of code. It's, well, Mike Webb, it's not the kidneys right now. It's because the road is so bumpy, man. I hit one of those bumps wrong and it tweaked my back. And now, with it being bumpy, it's, it's every single one's going to really suck. in Wendover. Wendover, Utah. How far is that? 348 miles. Uh, yeah, I know what you mean, Havoc. I, I get it, bro. Uh, well, it just started less than an hour ago, Dennis. So, probably about 11 hours from now. Matthew the King, what's up, brother? message man it's been a whirlwind of uh, communication according to that subject bro hello r and r get my copy they had bourbon pecan copy so yeah yummy oh that's so good Same 
here. I, I hope it's not true, but I'm preparing for the be uh, the worst, Matthew. another way. Dude! What's up, dude? <laughs> Welcome in. First time seeing you here. Welcome in. If poison is past its expiration date, is it more or less poison? Huh, good question. This is Interstate 80 in Wyoming, dude. Where's my car, man? We don't need 
Filipino mods, I mean badgers. <laughs> well, the only reason I like having mods in the chat is so people can drop links. And I'm definitely, with, you know, getting some of the trolls that we do in here, not going to give everybody a, a wrench. Just under 1,100 miles to my final destination, dude. Have a great day. Rest well or great night. Thanks for stopping in, man, and uh, congrats on that, by the way. Hope today you have an even better day and you're less sore. that Dennis Ow, god dang it I guess I could stop long enough to put a pillow behind my back try and stretch out now nah, we'll keep going fuck it other side. I got a semi right ahead of me. I like this view because it shows the hood of the truck. We can make it a little brighter doing that. Nerve or something going on in my back right now, Pop Tart. Other than that, I'm alright. 
it started an hour ago. Ron! Orkin? Orkin? Welcome in. By Lucky, hell yeah, Andrew. Uh, I mean, traffic really does die down, dude. It'll get even worse as the night progresses, but you know, once we get into Utah, it'll pick up a little bit. It'll really pick up once we get down by Salt Lake City. And then after we get outside, it won't be as bad. Um, and then once we get, you know, into Nevada, it'll die down again. It's better for you, Pop Tart. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, you will see it lagging and buffering from time to time, dude. I mean, I'm just running off of the phone, so it's not like I have Starlink or anything. <laughs> you know, if the if the channel grows enough, uh, I may possibly use any earnings from the channel to try and invest in Starlink. But I just don't have the money to get to get it started up. So. Storm chasers. A lot of storm chasers use Starlink. The bigger channels do. Hey, Duke. What's up, buddy? Good to see you. I saw your message come in, but can't really. Everybody's saying. I listen to the stream and it talks to me. You guys type it on the screen, talks to me. I know when it buffers.
Cats and Cubs trying to get a timeout. <laughs> So your daughter is suing you for a vehicle she bought. That's fucking weird. Pink Taco finally back on YouTube. What up? will look a lot different by just using the phone but for now uh, dude yes I have dash camera oh uh, pink taco needs a timeout all right there you go 